Hello everyone and welcome to Arcade Lord Guess. Uh, I'm, well, last episode I kind of tried to explain what I was trying to do with this uh, YouTube series. Uh, so instead of me bumbling around trying to explain to it while I'm playing the game, I thought I'd take a few minutes just to explain what my purpose was. Okay. Twenty-five cents equals one credit, and I start off with a dollar, so four credits. I will play until the end of the game or a certain time limit. Um, any money that I quote unquote spent will be uh, donated to SharingTheWeight.org. Uh, Sharing the Weight is an organization that makes blankets for special needs kids that helps them get a better night's sleep. Nineteen forty one. I will be uh I've already got my four credits loaded up as you can see, so they have already gotten a dollar for this episode. Um I'm going to be playing this until I believe I set myself for fifteen minutes, uh on here, uh, let's see. Uh, let me just do something here. Uh, let's see. Let me get a. I think this is it. There we go. Nice little timer. Um, I would usually set it up for 15 minutes, but it takes me. Let's see here. Here we go. So I've got. Uh, 15 minutes on the clock here, so I'm going to start playing here. If I go a little bit longer, oh well, that just helps uh, the charity, I guess. So, here we go. I've never really played this one before. So, uh, reminiscent, I think, of 1942, obviously. Gun firepower is a lot faster than... Oop, I died. A lot more busier than 1942. From when I played here, so. Oh, I got double sick. Yeah, no, 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 no. Man, things are just flying everywhere. So, yeah, basically, um, the reason why I keep mentioning 1942 is, is I actually played the hell out of that game. Uh, I got obsessed with it a few years ago when I bought it for my PlayStation 3 and I just sat there for, I think, hours playing it trying to beat the high score. Late at night, like at 2 in the morning. Whoa, 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 whoa! Missiles coming out of nowhere? What the? Oh. Nice. The little airplane's helping me out. I don't know where it says the credits there, so I've already, I believe, used up some credits. I know at least of one. Alright, let's see. I've always liked these type of games. The, the shooter ups are fun. Uh, however, I always question um, how come. Uh, I'm, I'm assuming we're. F I'm fighting for the U.S. Um. No, probably a bad assumption of mine. Ooh. Uh, before I finish my thought, the powers on this is a little bit different than other ones that I've played. I've never played 1941, so this is a brand new experience. I don't know what to expect. Um, blow up a boat here. <laughs> I mean, wow. Oh, oh. Environment actually plays a factor in this level. 
Nice. Uh, anyway, I'm getting distracted by everything that's happening on the screen here. Uh, like, I, what my thought was is, is, uh... How come the enemy has this huge armada? You know, it looks like an inexpen an inexhaustible amount of money. Oh, there goes my second credit. An inexhaustible amount of money to afford all this crap that they're shooting at me. I mean, all this stuff has got to cost billions upon billions upon billions of dollars. Stolen or not, this is quite expensive army. Yet, the country I'm, I, I fight for, and like I said, I'm assuming America, because I'm American, that's what we do. Uh, they're like, okay, we have this huge army that we have to fight and destroy. We're going to send one plane after it. <laughs> one measly little plane against a whole armada. And somehow, either we're fighting bumbling idiots because... Well, I should say bumbling. I mean, died a couple of times, but still, it's a, it's like they threw anybody that had remote, you know, helicopter or plane experience. They're like, here, go fight this super dude that eventually can. Anyway, I'm bumbling. Uh, all right. I, I I apologize for I mean I know I mumbled there for a minute there with my little theory but all right let's see here okay it's 25 cents it looks like so I'm on I think it's my last credit before I have to add more there's so much stuff going on I don't even know, like, I can kind of tell when a bullet comes towards me. Do I have a shield? I keep forgetting about my little second button there. I always just shoot. There's still something going on. I'm not done yet. There we go. So yeah, my whole point, my little rambling there back there was is basically, I always found it funny that they send one plane to fight an entire army. Get my little... Mm. anything actually hitting me? I, I can't tell. I know I'm blowing stuff up, but I can't tell if they're actually, like, it's been a... And everything looks like kind of like a mini-boss or a main boss, except for the little airplanes that come after me once in a while. Like... There we go. Oh, here we go. So I'm going to insert two more coins. One, two, or I guess it won't allow me one, so I'm at $1.25. Blow it up, blow it up, blow it up. There we go. And another thing, uh, back to the, you know, if this game was real, how did they build all this stuff without anyone noticing?
actually at a dollar fifty. Took my other coin. Cool. Alright, so let's see here. Wow, I mean just so much stuff. Oh, I got, got a laser knife. I think I'm spinning. Oh, one, two, put another 50 cent in. So now sharing the weight is up to $2 for this episode. I still got my laser, sweet. Oh, okay, I am spinning for some reason. What is this? Now I'm fighting a... It appears to be a rocket. Jesus! Move over, there we go. I got distracted with something. There we go. I think that's it is. So I'm a laser, nice. And is my phantom thing shooting? Blowing up random buildings? My phantom thing shooting. Well, Give them an even three dollars, shall we? Oop. Uh oh. Technical difficulty. I do apologize. Got four minutes or so. At least technical difficulty on my end. My screen went blank for a moment. Look at my other screen that has my timer. They do the little uh, environment thing. This is pretty cool. Ooh. And 
I like how I'm just shooting apparently everything I have on that plane. Ooh. Yeah, I'll take that. I don't know if it's healthy because I already had it, but... back. So was I fighting like hovering just above the ground on those last few levels? Yeah. I know it's pointless to argue the logistics of older games. I mean it's very 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 they're very very unrealistic but they're signing more giant airplanes after me versus the little tiny breakable ones. Oh man, I'm down just to my normal weapon. What happened to my... You know, probably lost it when I got distracted with stuff. Which I do apologize. Because I forgot one major component was my setup, which was setting my second screen so I could look at the timer, so I'm kind of guessing what my time is. Which, I mean, doesn't really matter. It's, it's so that way, because like some of these games will take me, you know what, dollar thirty. Dollar fit or three fifty I don't know what it was. Oh! In the nick of time! Man, they're shooting everything at me. giant airplane and seeing where I need to hit. Time is up, but I'll use up the I'll play till I die. So Enjoying the graphics of this game. It's kind of neat looking. That was the lamest review of graphics ever, but. Yeah. Hard to pay. There we go. Ooh, that is. Nice. 
Okay. Did I win? Oh, nope, guess not. Got my laser back. with the environment thing. Uh, I think that might be it. Yep, that's it. I didn't really know what level I left on here, but... Time is up, uh, and uh, let's see here. And I believe that sharing the weight is getting about. Let me do my calculations here. Uh, while I do that, uh, like I said, that was my first time playing the game. Um, nice little uh, shoot 'em up. Um, I, like I kept say, stating, oh, there's a lot of stuff happening uh, to pay attention to. And, you know, sometimes I was more trying to figure out where I was going uh, or just dodging stuff and trying not to talk. Because if I started talking, I'd be focusing on more of what I was doing or what I was talking about than what I was doing. I kept dying. Um, I mean, all around, I mean, it's just basically mindless shoot -em up Pretty fun, pretty fun. Uh, let's see here. Alright, calculations are in, and... Total amount we have is $3.50. Uh, that will go to sharing away, along with the $3 I earned the last uh, episode when I played Batman. So right now, they got, they got a grand total of... Uh, Six dollars and fifty cents going coming their way. Um, I know it doesn't seem like a lot, but it, every dollar amount counts, especially for that. Uh, for you don't know, I should probably explain what sharing the weight is. Uh, sharing the weight is a organization that makes weighted blankets for autistic uh, uh, kids. Um, basically, they have uh, they have issues sleeping. Sometimes they only get three hours of sleep or whatnot, and the weighted blanket helps them out. Uh, with the sleep, uh, with their sleep and everything, it's a great organization. Um, they t any, like I said, any dollar amount counts. Uh, they also take fabric, anything like that. Um, I believe their website is sharingtheweight.org. If you ever wanted to check it out, uh, they help a lot of kids, and they have a lot of kids waiting in line. So anything that can help out, that'd be great. If you just if you check it out and decide to donate, like I said, this is what I'm doing. Um, and that will be it for this episode. Uh, I do apologize here. I'm still kind of new at this. Um, hopefully, I'm going to actually be writing maybe like a script or something so I'm not mumbling and fumbling um, and that. So, uh, But other than that, I do thank you for watching. And I hope to see you next time on Arcade Argus. Uh, Argus, I mean. Sorry, God, I cannot pronounce my own title. Argus. <laughs> All right, so yeah, again, do apologize, but thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. ...to sharingtheweight.org. Uh, Sharing the Weight is an organization that makes blankets for special needs kids that helps them get a better night's sleep.